all right this is a very small video which basically I'll describe or show you how you can do encryption and decryption in org mode file content okay I am hoping that you have set up your PGP key to encrypt and decrypt for other reasons so the same key can be used in Emacs org mode okay to encrypt the content of a file and decrypt so without further ado let me get into Emacs uh, this is a org file I have already opened it and it has got some text okay so to encrypt it say for instance you write a heading here something like that uh, this is important okay along the line you just colon crypt and then colon okay now if you if you if you want to hide the, this content uh, from the others especially if you want to send it over the wire to somebody else okay or you, you have some sort of sensitive information here which you want to cloak with some uh, some guard so use your pgp key en encryption to guard this important information to do that the encryption happen only when you save the file i'm going to press control x control s see look at the bottom of the screen it is asking me for my passphrase of gpg key let me give so i have to type it again see the information gets encrypted okay the moment you save the file the information gets encrypted now how do you do that as as i show you how you can you just have to put a crypt tag like this and then you have to select or mention the particular region you want to hide or encrypt then just save the file while saving it will ask you for the past phase about your gpg key which will encrypt it now how do you decrypt it there is a command to um, org decrypt entry if you press enter see it didn't ask me for the for the key purse phrase because the keys have some sort of cache value in the memory you can easily disable that uh, cache value of the where when till that time the password is stored in memory that can be easily done with clear out the uh, cache which i haven't done so my password is still there in the memory okay so i decrypted it and it decrypted without asking me the password if the time pass on after a certain period of time when the cache time get invalidated when you tr then if you try to decrypt the content it will ask you to provide your passphrase again to get it decrypted right nice facility in this way you can put your important sensitive information and exchange between the parties over the wire by doing encryption okay i hope this will be useful to some people thanks for watching